changed. But the good news is, is I think they hashed it out today. I think they, you know, yeah, there I mean, were some apologies that were said today. I, so I've heard there have been some words exchanged at a few events around here lately. <laughs> so, you know, I mean... Uh, it's just, hey, sometimes this is the kind of stuff that happens, especially when you have two of these characters like this, that these are both characters that get in your face. Uh, losing to either one of these characters can be extremely frustrating. Yeah, so. no, for sure. Yes. Frostbite is, is the fan favorite from uh, North Carolina, though. I don't see too many of MDBA actually watching ZD. Oh, wow. Uh, but ZD has been running this region for a while now. Uh, mm -hmm. Down throw is going to be the play from Frostbite. What I love about Frostbite is that he's always going to try and keep you at the ledge, and not only that, but he's always going to try and, like, take you out. This man's neutral is surrounded by trying to just you know, kill you on ledge and, like, get this game over yep. as fast as possible. And it's easy to focus on Roy's speed and his kill power, and obviously those things are fantastic, but this man's ledge trapping, I think, gets underrated sometimes. Oh, yeah. yeah, and that's, like, that's what's going to make this situation upcoming right here very scary. You're not out of it yet. Yep. Not great by close. ZD, great recovery, that, looking for it, so. and unfortunately that's going to go in the opposite way that Frostbite wants, yeah, and ZD's going to go up, yeah. Here when we go, when I saw him running out of invincibility on the ledge, I was like, uh, I, you better have a plan here. Yeah, no, here we go, ZD though. What I love about ZD's gameplay is that it's aggressive but smart. I feel like what makes a good player from a top player is mm -hmm. to know when to turn off the aggression and like turn on the defense, and that up air from Frostbite though, going to be yeah. able to take it. So the thing that gets me about ZD, especially having watched him quite a bit since I moved here last year, mm -hmm. um, the thing about him is like he always knows what to do when his moves whiff. And I think that's yeah. always the thing that can catch a player of a character, Ooh. especially like Fox and Wolf, like two characters that you see the most from ZD. Uh, yeah, sometimes they don't get their first hit and then they don't know what to do, right? That's never going to happen with this Unfortunately, guy. Unfortunately, strong hit of back air not actually going to work out there. Oh, ZD so up. far That's took that move, first stock and like has been holding on to it really kind of closely since. I have seen unfortunate Excellent. some like weak hitboxes from Frostbite when he needs it, but it just came out now. He's going to be able to get that back air and he's going to be able to kind of go up here. Now, if I'm Frostbite, I'm going to do exactly what he's doing. He's kind of doing a vibe oh, check. You know what I mean? Like, grab. he's like, oh, uh, like if I get the combo, I'm going to push with it. If I don't, I'm going to kind of back up. But once again, Frostbite's neutral. So, so good. Here we go. Up there by ZD. He needs this stock. We know what Roy can do with Rage. Yeah, oh, this is definitely kill percent. Like, no doubt. <laughs> All right, here we go. Great parry by Frostbite. Badger, gonna go for the I was grab. <laughs> <laughs> Commentator's curse. Oh, yeah, and the oh, back air not going to okay. connect, but this the F-Till is going to send him off. Oh, okay. Man. Great by Frostbite. Even with the weak hits, he's still able to kind of work with it. Ooh, okay. He, Unfortunate, he's though. He's got to clean that up. Because, honestly, Frostbite is kind of dominating this game, but has flubbed two edge guards. Yep. And that's he was not doing that last night. When I was commentating him last night, he was very clean on the ledge. Mm -hmm. uh, not yet. Flare blade out of neutral. Here we go. Looking for something. Yeah, the blazer, absolutely. The blazer. Uh, <laughs> Love that. <laughs> All right, here we go. Looking for something. ZD playing oh, wow. so you patiently with the back that air. Jab. That's crazy. Gonna jump right in. Yeah. Good on Frostbite. Gonna be able to maintain the pool because, man, mm. that first game was a little messy. Or the first stock, I should say, in the first game was a little bit more messy. Oh, both of those times that Frostbite died, he yep. held onto the ledge too long. Yep. ZD waited a little bit longer to do the upbeat than he expected. Even the one time where he hit the tech, he still ended up dying. And, like, I, I felt like I could see the plan. I thought he was trying to set up a counter. Maybe a back Maybe. air, which we saw with the, to punish the illusion on the second stock for ZD. But, like, honestly, right now, Frostbite's winning the match well enough on stage that it might not even matter. That's very true. This is only game one, though. We are going to go to Final Destination game two. What do you think about this pick for Fox? So, like, obviously everybody is afraid of this character with platforms on the triplat layout, especially because of platform extensions, right? But now, if Fox juggles you and you lose a resource like an air dodge or a double jump, how are you landing? Explain to me how you are ever <laughs> landing against that. I don't so, know. I don't know. So far, ZD hasn't been, you know, landing too well. Frostbite going to be able to go up. But here's ZD's first kind of combo here. <laughs> Looking for something. Backs off. It's gimp percent. No, ZD jumps a little too high on okay, that one. Excellent. Yeah, and then the ledge trapping also gets that much scarier. Like, it's just that much harder to get past this wall of nares that ZD will sometimes put at the ledge. Oh, but that is a jab backer, and we are out of here. All righty, here he goes. I love how Frostbite essentially picked it up. I think he realized that he's playing a little messy. The hitboxes aren't working in his favor, but right now he's just kind right. of... He's always there with the crab, Jackie. Like exactly, I love yeah. when I love when players offer jabs more than going for aggression. But oh my God, speaking of aggression, that up smash. 
Well, yeah. Also, I think Frostbite do is doing an interesting thing in his grab game where he's looking for the follow-up grab if there's another air dodge out of the pressure. It's really good. Yeah. Okay. Right. Yep. Kill percent. <laughs> it's he kill just, percent. He just ran up and got it again. That's crazy. Uh, just going to neutral get up that time. Oh, but got to yeah. find it Excellent. again. Oh, my God. The way that that jab anti-airs, man. That uh, uh, like ZD is just going to have to figure out a way to get around it. Because, like, he, it's clear that he knows what's going to happen. It's like, I'm going to jump over this. And then Roy's jab is like, no, you're not. Nope. All right, here we go. Neutral B trying to bake the shield out a little bit. Now, this is, you know, still mm -hmm. very, very close. I know. Yeah, um, excellent. Yep, there oh, it is. and <laughs> the accidental cross-up from Frostbite. I, I wonder if he didn't tell that ZD was facing with back to ledge there. Miss Tech from Frostbite seems to work out in his favor, though. ZD can easily take this match back, but unfortunate with grab. Good, good tech roll. Big damage. Yeah, get him up in the get him up in the. Yeah, he he jumped. I was like, what what are you doing over there? But yeah, he jumped. I think between the second and third. Kind of doing it out once again. ZD gonna shark the ledge just a little bit. Nair from ledge though, great from frostbite. Yeah. But ZD with these grabs once again has everything. Gets the parries. Yep, and smart just taking jab there. I don't think he had a better punish. Yeah. All that right, looking for really it. Safe. Ooh, gets Excellent. the read. Yeah, great reaction too. Oh my god, great by ZD. Take the power back. And that's the thing about ZD, what I, what I was saying before, where he knows what to do and he whiffs. Yeah. Part of that is because he doesn't overcommit after every button that right. he presses, right? And so in that case, he was there waiting to react to the... Uh, so it's like the read part is that he's not, like, initiating a dash after the hit, mm -hmm. but he's still able to react because Absolutely. he was just standing there. It's so yeah. good. Great by ZD. You got the T-Door boys in the background screaming for their their mans. Frostbite. Did he go back to Roy, yeah? Okay, okay. Yeah. Who else it, it, oh, it was a color. It was a color change. I was like, what is that? Okay, we're good. We're good. Yoshi's story. Y'all have this legal down here. Here at Tri-State, we don't, we don't have that. Yeah, um, so this uh, this rule set is uh, Smash World Tour. Tour. So this uh, predated Hollow Bastion. Uh, I do wonder if we're going to change. Because uh, if you were watching last night, we were running the Hazards On rule yes, set. Yes, it's very interesting. I don't love that either. Ooh, okay. <laughs> neutral getup from Frostbite. I know for a lot of people, they'll go for like the getup attack. But mm. I feel like neutral getup is actually pretty helpful. Oh, look uh, at this man, you just playing around platforms. We're getting into the layers here. <laughs> it's like an onion, right? Yeah, absolutely, the yummy. <laughs> All okay. right, ZD, Juggles. though, going to be able to get a couple melee up airs in there. Yeah, yeah honestly, surprised it ended so early. Okay, yeah, going low. Ooh, okay, Ooh. downer into the fair. Nice, beautiful, and strong hit. Going to go for it again, but ZD, nice angle to come back up. But up tilt says, tilt. Yeah, yeah, I'm good. Interesting. So I wonder if the reason why we're going to Yoshi's here no, wait, this was ZD's pick, wasn't it? Mm, no, it's Frostbite. No, this was Frostbite. Okay, yeah, so to have the <laughs> wall, so ZD can't do the thing where he goes under the stage and gets the perfect... Oh, uh, yeah, the perfect angle. Yeah. yeah, it's working out, and strong hits a plenty for Frostbite right now. Ooh, great weight. I'm gonna yeah, side B right into the shield, but great punish by ZD. Here we go. That's a little bold of him to let that rip, honestly. <laughs> a little bold, Because yeah. one of the fourth side B just comes out. All right, here we go. Great tech by ZD. Gonna look for mm -hmm. something. Ooh, grab, yeah. grab exchange. Nice Grabbing dash disjoints in 2021. Yeah. Oh, I don't know. Ooh, okay, Excellent. waited too yep. long on that ledge. Here we go, 77% on ZD. I feel like I've watched ZD play from behind this entire time, if not percentage-wise, but like aggression-wise. Certainly feels like it. Great, oh my god, up really? there. <laughs> okay, yeah, you got it, you got that it. That programming <laughs> moment, as I like to call uh -huh. it. All right, here we go. Juggles, yeah. All right, nice nair to the fair once again. Good tech. Yeah, great by ZD. He's playing very well, like, it's defensively. It's scary in that situation, because if you're under the platform and you air dodge there, you might just eat a ton of damage. Mm -hmm. yeah, Ooh, grab. Great grab. Yeah, once again. Up bears. Can't get the juggle, though. Going to go high in the sky. Ooh, forward throw once again. Yep. That's good on ZD holding up out of that forward throw. That can be a much scarier spot for Fox. You know what? I appreciate that down air. I was like, you know what? I, I'm up a stock. Forget it. Ooh, Illusion, though. Got to watch out. We talked about that last set. Illusion is a punishable move. Yeah, I think if Frostbite can cross up with down air, it's fairly safe. Like, you, you can't up smash it if he crosses up. All right, side B comes out. Dancing Blade. Ooh, we oh, can the, the wet noodle. <laughs> It hurts. Oh, oh come where are you on. going? Yeah, that's not worth it. it that is not sick. worth it. It would have been sick, but you know what? <laughs> oh, Points, yeah. I suppose. Yeah, that's not safe on hit. That is not safe on hit. Side B right in the face. Mm -hmm. All right. Well, 2-1 right now for Frostbite. ZD, we know he has a wolf. Um, I know the Luigi came out not too that's long right. ago. I believe, that, I believe that was a Halloween special. Halloween special. <laughs>
<laughs> oh man, spooky. Oh, yeah, I was terrified. That's you ever, sure. you ever just, you know, you're playing somebody and like, hey, I have a crazy pocket, random mid tier, and you're like, oh my god. <laughs> Not like this. How, how did he know I have a Ganon problem? Not like this. Alrighty, well, here we go. Game number four. ZD's got to pick it up, otherwise All he's right, heading right sure. into losers, but. PS2, we love it, mm -hmm. love it. I'm assuming we're at the, the point here where it's just going to be a bunch of neutral stages for the rest of the set, Ooh. so. Great combo by yeah. ZD there. A lot of little hits that counted all together. Frostbite, though, the spacing between both these players, Jackie, has been phenomenal this game. It's great up air. That up air back here is so powerful. It hurts. All right, down oh, Ooh, the down tilt trade. actually connected. Yeah, going to go for the up air. Is going to be able to find it. Going for this next one. Great, great grab. Oh grab. Yeah. He's in his head a little bit, Jackie, this one. Once and again. And yet, they're both at kill percent. Yeah, no. <laughs> ZD, oh. ZD is going for these grabs. Like, he is very adamant about getting it. But there's that down air that Good Frostbite that. wanted last game. And he's going to be able to send him off. Really nice okay. start into stock two. But unfortunately, ZD is not going to be able to get that up smash that he was looking for. Yeah, it was incredible spacing on that downer, though. Okay, yeah, here we go. Very even, very even game four. All right, here we go. What you want to see, right? All right, here we go, Nair. Oh my god, I love so the way... So ready for these spots. Yeah, no, I'm so... I'm loving the way that Frostbite's, like, actually engaging. Like, he's moving himself back, but doing, like, the... He's doing the up air, too. It's so creative. Roy up air. That might be... It, it, it's up there. It's one of the best moves in the game, for sure. Like... It just does so much for you. All right, here we go. Ooh, little little sticky both sides. And now we are at the point where every play on the ledge is terrifying. Oh, that's the first time we saw that up B oh, out of neutral here. And you're going to get punished for that. ZD is not that type. ZD has advantage on the ledge, but I love the disengage by Frostbite. Great on him to realize, you know what? Maybe I should just start over in neutral. But here we are in the ledge again. Oh, okay. Okay. Nice. The ledge, oh, is the ledge slip, and he buffered an air dodge trying to peck. Unfortunate. Yep, that, that is an ultimate moment right there. <laughs> we have all been there. All right, going for the down tilt. Nothing going to be home. Rising fair from ZD. Smart. We haven't seen that yet. Mm -hmm. I feel like I feel like now Frostbite's kind of fishing for an aerial. Like Right. And I mean, he's just not like landing with that spaced up air. I, like, at a certain point, you can't do anything about that. But he's, he's got to find the spacing again. All right, this ZD. is dominant from ZD right now. Yeah, ZD going to be able to oh, get the it. F smash. I can't. I Bold. couldn't tell. I think that had to be a jump. Had to have been. Yeah, once again, I felt like he was kind of fishing for the aerials, uh -huh. which probably left him pretty vulnerable. Head into a game five yeah, and on then, the other side. Yeah, Frostbite just got going too fast there at the end. ZD will eat that alive. But yeah, love seeing a game five in a set like this. This is great. Mm -hmm. All righty, well, I feel like it's going to come down to stage. Sure. So, I mean, yeah, I, I got to imagine that ZD will not allow Yoshi's again, and I have to imagine he was already ban banning Kalos. Because walls, walls seemed like part of Frostbite's oh, plan, he's, right? Oh, he's thinking about it, though. He's hovering in that direction. Yeah, if, Cal if, if Kalos is open, I have a feeling that's where we're going. What about Lilac? Come on, Back everyone's FD, favorite. <laughs> Yeah, I would. Uh, I would love Jungle Japes. Do you remember Colo switching off of Roy of on Lilat? So yes. I don't think we're gonna see that. Oh, <laughs> ZD running away. We're looking where he's going. Yep. Look at this man off go. The races. Yeah, we are at the we are, we at, the are horse at the horse track. track yes. Uh, is he asking for advice? <laughs> oh, he's probably asking on a clarification on rule set. Oh, they're probably asking about uh, MDSR or not MDSR, yeah. which might uh, depend on whether or not we are going back to a walled stage. Right, because we well, ZD did win that last game. So. Right, that's what I'm saying. But if ZD didn't realize that he had to ban Yoshi's again, yeah, true. All right, here we go. <laughs> I love the random hovers. I want to be opposed to Smashville, okay. but yep, we're gonna go yeah. PS2. Sure, I can. Uh, Smashville, I feel like is great for both of them. I think this stage is great for both of them. I think we're running out of stuff with the walled stage gone. That's a clear advantage for Frostbite, so yeah, I why not? love how ZD stayed Fox this entire set. Yeah, no panic switches to Wolf or anything. Nope. You know, his pit was giving out the hands Yeah, and so I didn't know that <laughs> ZD played pit. Yeah, I mean, he like... has, like, a lot of really good characters. Like, he could he could go, like, there was one Xanadu where he just went Rob and got, like, third, you know? <laughs> Rob is big. Rob is big. Rob is also good. All right, here we go, though. 
Frostbite started with the advantage here, but now ZD is kind of going to pick it right back up. He's got to watch that, though. I feel like if Frostbite trusts his shield a little bit more, he's going to be able to get some of these punishes. Yeah, Frostbite is starting to do a good job of recognizing the aerial into up tilt mix up. Uh, not there, though. Even with the parry, just didn't <laughs> catch cross up. Yeah, once again, some of these aerials are kind of betraying Frostbite in terms of um, like hitboxes oh, here. Yeah. Ooh, great, great parry. parry. Jeez. <laughs> in the face. Yeah, in the was face. That, was that a neutral get up out of the tech? Yes. Well, what a catch. Like, you could, I, I would have been afraid to go for that as ZD because I would have been like, oh, oh he's definitely going to get up attack. Three out of four aerials there, sour spotting five. Yep. There okay, go. this is good. He's got him where he wants him. Doesn't catch the jab. Gotta watch these fares from the ledge. That's yeah. not, not the first time that ZD actually fared from the ledge there. Ooh, it's my a God. very common Fox move, but like, and it's the perfect thing to beat the the searching jabs, right? Oh my God! Wow. Dancing Blade from underneath the platform is gonna take it. Seventy-six percent on Frostbite, so we know yeah, that this wait. is gonna do some damage now and quickly racked up that forty percent. Yeah, it's these back facing up airs. It's just like that's a wall. What do you do about that? All right, here we go. You wait for him to misface it as well. Yeah, do. right. You just wait. Oh, it's terrifying. Yeah, he just came up. I don't think ZD was ready for it because I think that was the first time Frostbite didn't snap the That's ledge. It? Oh my god, he rolled yeah. behind Dancing Blade. Mm. <laughs> what? Jeez. Mm. Was That's that outplay or was that just ultimate hitboxes? Yes. Okay. <laughs> and here we go. The tides have turned everybody. Oh, there's an air. Yeah, and there he misses is. that tech, and that's a tough spot, because if you miss the platform and you air dodge, you die. So. From DBA cheering for their boy. Up out of shield. That's not the first time Frostbite has done that, but that is the second time it randomly missed. Third time, and he's going to get punished for this. I don't know. Maybe it's kind of a reaction there, but I wouldn't suggest it. Ooh, oh, great okay. grab. I'm surprised he didn't back throw, but I guess he wanted the, the combo. so weak, and you, you have no advantage. No. Oh my god, here we go, chasing him, but great nair mm. by Frostbite to say, hey, back up a little bit. Gonna These be able to find the strong hit. Are both catching so many tomahawk grabs on the platforms. I love it. And that's something like if you play either of these characters or really any rush down, that's definitely take notes on that. It's so important. Neutral get up from the ledge. This is it. ZD has the opportunity, Another finds one. the F smash, and that's gonna be it. Frostbite got up from ledge multiple times just in neutral. And I he didn't I didn't even see him throw out a uh, Get up attack once. Yeah, sure. I mean, honestly, oh, it didn't see a roll either. I didn't see a roll a either. And ZD was all on like, I'm not going to let you do any of these like None. get ups that get up vertically right above the ledge, just saying no to all that. Excellent great stuff. Play. Yeah, great play from both players. Hyper um, adaptation going on. In that oh set. yeah, for sure. Excellent. I'm so once again, I am beyond glad we did not see a switch. I'm yeah. so glad yeah. he just stayed Fox the entire time. I believe we're gonna. I think we're dropping down into.